elderly New York man was stabbed in the head and face with a screwdriver in an unprovoked attack on a subway train. No arrests have been made yet. And an attack like this is again raising concern about the safety of the subway in New York. Let's talk about this story even further. Joining us now for more Fox 5 New York reporter Michelle Ross joining us. Uh, and Michelle, thanks so much for being with us here. Uh, what a scary, scary attack here. Do police have any leads? Yeah, it definitely was a scary attack, but right now we do know that the victim is expected to be okay. He's expected to recover, but it's attacks like these that keep riders here in New York City on the subway system on edge. Passengers will just be minding their own business until someone randomly comes out of nowhere and attacks them, whether it's with their bare hands or with a weapon. And last night, that weapon was a screwdriver. And tonight, the suspect is still on the run. The guardian angels are on patrol one night after a man was attacked on the subway with a screwdriver. It's horrifying, but it's the kind of thing that keeps us out here. Uh, it's the kind of thing that we hope to at least deter, if not intercede in. The 61-year-old victim received a police escort on the subway platform with his head wrapped in white bandage. Police say he was on a southbound one train at around 9.45 Thursday night, heading towards Columbus Circle, when the suspect, holding a screwdriver, stabbed the man in the head and face in an apparent unprovoked attack. I was happy that I wasn't here because I would have been here at that time. That's the time that I'm on this train. The attack is alarming for subway riders. I feel frightened because there are a lot of people and I know it's a mental health issue and I respect that, but I just don't feel like it's as safe as it should and could be. The MTA saying this incident was senseless and unacceptable and we are grateful nobody was seriously injured. The NYPD has full cooperation from our transit security camera team and when the perpetrator is arrested, he should face aggressive prosecution delivering justice with consequences. This has been a violent week within the subway system. On Tuesday, a man allegedly tried to prevent a mugging at the NRW station at 49th Street by opening fire inside the station. As subway crime continues to be a concern for riders, the Guardian Angels hope to bring calm and relief. Usually we're not lucky enough to actually be there to help when the attacks happen, but you know we hope that at least our presence helps keep things a little saner, a little safer. And essentially that's what the Guardian Angels do. They try to find those blind spots within the public safety enforcement system and try to provide safety and help out wherever they can. But again, that suspect is still on the run. The victim is expected to recover. That's the latest live here on the west side of Manhattan. Michelle Ross, Fox 5 New York. All right, uh, Michelle, thanks so much for bringing us this story tonight here on Live Now from Fox. I think for your debut, we'll definitely be speaking again. Thanks.